Hey, what's up, friends? Welcome to my channel. This is Angel from According to Angel over on Instagram. If you guys are new here, thank you so much for stopping by. And if you are a returning subscriber or friend, thank you so much for your continued love and your continued support. On today, at this moment, guys, this is my third video of today. I am so proud of myself. But, anyways, I have my mini Happy Planner in front of me right now. Um, this week I'm going to use vertical pages, as you guys can see here. And this is for uh, the week of Mother's Day, which starts on May the 2nd through May the 8th. And I'm going to go in with the Form House Making a Mini Sticker Book. The neutral watercolor sticker book and the uh, happy and grateful sticker book all by the happy planner so I already have the stickers that I want to use pulled mostly as you guys can see here the only thing that I haven't pulled I think are uh, bullet points but when I get to that we'll Pull them then. So, without further ado, I'm going to go on and get started. First, I'm going to place my Minnie Mouse sticker on the left side of the page at the bottom, right here, where this little important block is. I'm going to cover that up with her. Uh, And of course, some of her will have to get cut out for the page, but that's okay. She'll just be hanging out on the side of the page. So, that's her. Then, on the bottom, the right side of the page, I put Mickey. He's a lot smaller than she is, but um, I still think that... Uh, It'll work out. So we're gonna stick him right here. All right. Yeah, let's find our scissors so that we can cut out the extra. So how's it going everyone? How is the weather where you guys are? Right now in my state, it is some kind of hot. So hot that I wish I was still up north. <laughs> That's how hot it is right now. But, um, anyways. Guys, I'm trying to feel a lot better with a uh, small talk, having a topic for you all while I'm working on these spreads because um, I feel like it's important to engage and have a little fun with you all while you're watching me work. So, I'm really trying. I'm mostly a quiet type person, but trying to, you know, work on talking more. Okay. Now let's clean those scissors off. Alright. That. Okay. Next up, this double white box that says live in a moment. I'm going to take that and put it on the bottom of Monday. Right here beside Mini. Uh, 
Okay, so I'm going to have to lift her up off of the page a little in order for me to make this work. Guys, this is a mini planner, and the stickers that I'm using are mostly classic sized. But, so I'm sure a lot of you know by now, especially if you aren't new, you can use whatever size sticker in whatever size planner. You've just got to be creative. placement I think it might be yeah that's cool right there Just getting some of those wrinkles out okay alrighty I think that looks good moving on I have little hexagons here and I want to put the decorative elements here in this um, top corner. So let's stick that one in first and then let's do this one. I'm going to leave just a little bit of space in between those. Okay. And the third one. Let's stick it right here. Alrighty. I lost the hexagon somewhere. Oh my gosh. That's what I get for halfway sticking these stickers on the right paper. I'm pretty sure it's somewhere behind me in the massive mess that I have back here. Uh, but I'll worry about that a little bit later. Moving on. I have this big old circle sticker. And it says, Think Happy Thoughts. This is something that I um, take near or dear to heart because as I stated in my classic video sometimes I feel like giving up this whole YouTube journey but I can't think that way I've got to just keep working really hard on making my channel what I want it to be so thinking happy thoughts would definitely help me to be motivated more. You guys are following what I'm saying. Then here I have a quote that says she just shines. Yes guys. Angel shines and shines like a light. I want to take this quote and put it Somewhere on this page, I'm thinking of cutting it in half, kind of like this, and then putting this part of it on the left side of the page like that and then put the other part on the opposite side of the page kind of like that what do y'all think y'all think that looks cute i do i think it turns out pretty dookie dookie 
So Mia for some function. Still in with some of the boxes that I pulled. Okay, we're gonna, this is a vertical box, but we're gonna use it horizontally, okay? And we're gonna take this one and put it right here on Thursday, but make sure we don't cover thoughts in the quote. Let me just turn it this way so I can see a little bit better. I have a new studio light too, guys, that I'm um, currently testing out. It wasn't very expensive compared to all the other lights that I use. Yes, I have a lot, a lot, a lot of lights. y'all in just a second. I don't want to rip my page. Okay. That's good. But yeah, I have a lot, a lot, a lot of lights. I have my beautiful pink 18-inch ring lights that I purchased from some website. I forgot the website now. And I also have a bunch, like a bunch, bunch of smaller ring lights, 12 inches, um, 6 inches, 8 inches, stuff like that. Forgive the noise in the background, just my sister and her one-year-old son having a Fun mom slash fun mom. So, that. Because look at that so far. How cute is it? It is neutral and just perfect. Okay. It, um, kind of, let's go back to that light that I was talking about. I was at Walmart and um, I. I really don't know what I was looking for. I think I was just looking for a reason to have to spend some money. But, um, I ran across the electronics side and I saw this studio light. I thought it was cute. So I purchased it and it was like um, a little bit under $40. So far so good. There's an app that you have to download that controls the settings of the light. It turns it on and off. But um, yeah, I think it's a really, really nice light. So. Let's put this one. Here. Okay. Then let's take this header that says today's list and put her here. All right. And instead of punching it, we'll just take our scissors. You see a little extra here? We'll just take our scissors and cut that little piece off.
not perfect, but hey, could have fit on back into the disc. So that's that. Alright, it's looking really nice so far. Now we're going to go in with some of these watercolored um washi strips. And can take the first one and stick it down here. I think I want it to go all the way to the edge of this page. Alright, make his tail have to be lifted just a bit. A smidge. Smooth that tail that got on. Alright. That's good. And we'll take another one. And put it over here. because we don't want it to go over the uh, box. Alright, do that. So far, so cute. And let's go in with some more of these watercolor boxes. I just like the look of them. Okay. So let's do this guy right here. And then this guy can go here. Here, guys, we're going with the flow. Okay. Alright, and let's put this guy. I prefer him right here. So let's bring Mickey's head now. looking really nice so far and because this box is mostly in Sarah it's technically for Sunday so I'm gonna use this tomorrow header so let me know that the plans that are right here will be for Sunday Okay, that's 
cold. Okay, it's cold. Yeah, I'm looking for that other hexagon. Honestly, I don't think I have another. Another one just like that one in my sticker book. Give me you guys here. Loudness. It's just me. Rocking planners and stuff on the floor. Oh boy, oh boy. Okay. That sticker really did disappear somewhere. So let's pull that sticker book back and look and pray. We're not going to put them in the same order, but um, I believe, let's see, where do I think they'll fit best? All right, we're going to try them down here. Okay, let's do that one. Some of these little slags now. And the Miranda Page a little. I'm so sorry about the uh, background noise. to be quiet while I was recording this video, but hey, it is a one-year-old baby, so enjoy. Alright, just picking in some flags now. I want you guys to see just how cute you can make a spread without going like totally crazy with uh, decorations. Baby, I am loving, loving, loving this spread so far. Um, I want to add in a couple of bullets. I mean, checklist. I'm going to add, I'm going to add checklist. But, um, these are going to be a little bit too long. So, what I'm going to do is cut this one in half to kind of see what it'll look like. Up here. I'm gonna do that. That's the question. Do I want to do that? Is the question. Now we're gonna 
scratch the checklist and use bullets instead. Just because um, there's so much going on on the pages already and I really don't want to overwhelm it any more than it already is. So I'm going to go in with some bullets. Sticker piercer. over here and go with the brown. Probably take one more. in the back. A brown. brown color is so pretty to me. And let's take a white and pink kind of one. Okay. here and then add one more maybe here Yeah. 
that I want to do is add some more of that watercolor uh, washi strip. I'm going to turn this page this way because I want it in the sidebar. Right, let's pull a mini up a little bit. piece right here. Neutral water watercolor sticker book, guys. So let's take this little piece here. So proud of my work today, guys. So, yeah, guys, this is it. This is my mini happy planner spread for the week. I think she turned that so, 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 so cute. And I used the neutral watercolor sticker book by the happy planner. I used the happy and grateful sticker book by the happy planner. And I use the farmhouse Mickey and Minnie sticker book by the head planner. If you guys like this video, give your girl a thumbs up and subscribe. Guys, please subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Leave a comment down below. When you subscribe, make sure you hit the push notification bell so that you'll be notified every single time your girl uploads a new video. And as usual, guys, I'll catch y'all in my next video. Bye!